DJ Finest. Nice. Hi guys, it's Ubi CEO. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new. If you haven't subscribed on my channel, go click that subscribe button to be updated on my latest videos and go follow me on my Instagram account at Luis Ia. So for today's video, as you have seen on the title, is another makeup tutorial. This makeup look is very important to me because as I have said before on my very first video, I want to help Morena girls out there to achieve the best makeup look for them. So before yung first video ko, ang in-upload ko is a natural makeup look for Morenas. And if gusto niyo yung konting makeup lang, yung natural looking lang talaga, hindi kayo pupuntang events or things like that, you can watch that. I will link it down below. You can check it out. But if you want that makeup look na pagpupunta kayo sa mga debut, sa mga events, or kahit ano pa man na gusto nyo magmukhang glam, this is for you. So in this video, I'll be talking about um, some tips on the shades na bagay sa mga morena and kung ano yung talagang swak sa skin tone natin. Kasi mahirap yan. I've been there before. So if you wanna see how I did this look, please continue watching. Okay guys, all of you might know this already, pero ang pinaka-important part talaga is yung priming your face. Lalo na if dry and oily yung face mo. So for me, I have a dry face, so I invest more on moisturizers. And ito yung holy grail ko, Lux Organic Soothing Gel. For the next step, I'm also gonna use another moisturizer. Ito guys yung gagamitin ko from the face shop. This is a pure brightening emulsion. I am not sure how much this is, pero you can get it sa the face shop. I'll show you guys, kasi more of water-based siya. And sobrang ganda nito sa face, and I love the smell. Bagay na bagay siya dun sa aloe vera ko. And the last step sa priming ko is this Stila One Step. Prime. So, bigay lang to ng friend ko and sobrang nagustuhan ko siya agad. Sobrang okay siya for dry skin kasi ayaw ko nung priming products na mattifying. See how it blends so easily. I don't know if kita sa camera kung gano ka alive na yung face ko pero from kanina to now, Oh, ready, ready na for makeup. For foundation, guys, I have two products on my hand. Kasi I wanna tell you kung ano yung magwork for the Marade skin type. So for me before, nung hindi ko pa alam na acidic ako or na nag-oxidize talaga yung mga makeup, hindi pa ako ganun ka-educated about makeup, I use this 228 Soft Tan, which really works. And ito yung Fit Me Foundation from Maybelline. Sobrang okay nito. Bagay na bagay siya sa skin tone ko. And for sure din, if Mariana kayo like me, ito babagay rin sa inyo. But since I am acidic, two shades lighter dapat yung um, foundation ko. So I use this Infallible from L'Oreal. And it's in the shade 150. So, medyo light siya sa akin pag ilalagay ko ngayon and if makikita nyo. But trust me, since I am acidic, mag-oxidize siya. For blending, I'll be using this diamond um, blender from Gil Techniques. Sobrang bilis ito makablend guys kasi ganyan siya flat. So, ganyan lang ako mag-blend and it really works fast, lalo na pag nagmamadali kayo. For the concealer, I'll be using this Fit Me from Maybelline again. I'm in the shade 20 Sand. With the same blender, I'll be blending the concealer. So let's start with the forehead. Sobrang helpful pala ng diamond na shape na blender. I will set my foundation and concealer with the Laura Mercier Translucent Powder. With the powder brush from Real Techniques, TBH, I really don't like this baking part because 
I have a dry face. Pero sabi ni Jacqueline Hill, importante pa rin daw mag-bake kahit dry yung face mo. So I'll be blending that later. I'll be heading on with my brows. For the eyebrow pencil, I'll be using this the Face Shop Designing Eyebrow um, Pencil. This has been my holy grail and I'm in the shade number 3. Almost lahat ata ng makeup tutorial ko ito yung gamit. After the eyebrow pencil, I move on with this Life Brow from Sunny's Face. I'm not sure what shade this is, but ito yung brown shade. Kasi parang meron dun black grayish shade. So ito yung brown. May I just tell you that sa Morenas talaga, feeling ko bagay yung brown na eyebrows. Feeling ko mas umaangat yung skin color nila if brownish black yung eyebrows instead of pure black. After the brows, let's blend the powder. For the contour, I'll be using this Careline Better Than Basic Contour Stick. Since favorite ko talaga yung bronzer and contour, iset natin yung cream na contour with the Hula from Benefit. For the eyeshadow, I'll be using two eyeshadow palettes, which is the Tarte Clay Play and the Eye Magic Professional Cosmetics. With this brush, I'll be using Ember. There. Ganyan yung shade niya, guys. If wala naman kayong gantong palette, you can always um, look for other kinds of palette. Basta kung ano yung meron kayong nude palette, go with it. And I'm just focusing on my crease and on the outer part of my eye. And then you use this Profesh. Ganyan siya, medyo burgundy shade sa eye magic na palette. And then sa middle ko na mag-focus. Once you're done with profesh na shade, you move on with the smoked. And mas darker siya kaysa sa profesh and mas sa reddish side na siya. So guys, for mga morenas, pinaka okay talaga yung mga nudish, orangish, and kind of darkish red. Pwede rin tayo gumamit ng mga bright eyeliners, like yellow and all those kinds. Maganda siya sa skin natin. But for me, I just wanna keep it classic, like yung nudish, um, orangey type na eyeshadow. But I wanna have um, shimmer. So for the shimmer, I'll be using this one, yung pinaka light. <laughs> And then last step for the eyeshadow is under yung waterline nung eyes natin. And I'm gonna use this brush para manipis lang siya and matigas. So madali siya for the waterline. And I'll be using the shade Smoked. Yung na dun sa darkish red na um, shade. See, it really makes a difference. Mas nagpapop yung eyes natin kapag meron under. For my blush, I'll be using this blush brush from Real Techniques as well, dun sa um, shimmer na edition. And this um, Chris blush, and it's on the shade Lasting Love. And as you can tell, yung um, shade ng blush niya is medyo nudish pa rin, hindi yung pure red or things like that. And don't forget the nose bridge, kasi kahit konti lang. It makes a difference. Finally, setting spray, and I'll be using this MAC Prep and Prime. Before putting on mascara and highlight, mag set na muna tayo ng face. And since nag big tayo ng face, marami dapat yung setting spray natin. But ganon! For the highlighter, I'll be using this Dandelion from. Benefit and I really love this because it's natural yung finish niya and I'll be using this fan brush hey, 
For the mascara, I'll be using this Lash Paradise from L'Oreal. And for a mascara like this, na ang thick nung wand, ang hirap maglagay ng mascara. Laging napapalampas or nadikit. So yung excess dapat talaga ng alsen. So I use a tissue for it. Look at that. Sobrang dami. Kaya talagang need mong a tissue. And then finally for the lips, I suggest that you use nude um, color. If not nude, then more on the orangey pinkish side. Not pink lang or reddish talaga. But if you wanna use red, if you're morena, go for the red. Yung real red lang. Hindi ko ano ano pa yung ibang klase ng red. So what I'm gonna use is this Sunny's um, lipstick, the Fluff Matte, which is very good and I love the shade. Sobrang bagay nito sa morena. The shade big. Pero if maputi ka, yung labas nung shade na to is super orange na parang hindi okay. But if your skin tone is like me, sobrang swak siya sa skin tone. <laughs> Ayan o, tamang-tama lang yung pagka-orange-reddish side nung lipstick. Sobrang ganda nung shade. There, so ayusin lang natin yung hair ko and then we can move on with the final look. So that's it guys for this video. If you liked it, go click that like button and share the video. See you again on my next video. Bye, love lots!